we will explore some major threats to biodiversity such as habitat loss poaching of wildlife man wildlife conflicts endangered and endemic species with a special focus on india let's dive in and learn more about these critical issues biodiversity is the result of 3.5 billion years of evolution it encompasses a vast variety of ecosystem species and genes all adapted to different climates and environments biodiversity is vital for our planet's health and stability but it's under threat from various human activities some of the main threats includes habitat loss poaching of wildlife man wildlife conflicts endangered and endemic species habitat loss is a major threat to biodiversity it is caused by overpopulation urbanization industrialization deforestation and this leads to reduced ecosystem variety and decreased genetic diversity the causes of habitat loss and biodiversity loss includes overpopulation urbanization industrialization deforestation pollution overexploitation development and climate change consequences of habitat loss and biodiversity loss includes reduced ecosystem variety decreased genetic diversity loss of species disruption of ecosystem processes and negative impacts on human health and well-being and here are the examples of habitat loss first deforestation which leads to loss of habitat for many species coral reefs degrading due to pollution and climate change amazon rainforest facing severe fragmentation and deforestation decrease in crop diversity due to deforestation and agricultural expansion here are the mitigation strategies for habitat loss implementing policies and practices to reduce pollutants and greenhouse gas emissions enacting laws and conservation measures to safeguard vulnerable species and the ecosystems they depend on and encouraging farming methods that conserve biodiversity reduce habitat destruction and minimize environmental impacts such as soil degradation and water pollution next educating the public policy makers and stakeholders about the importance of biodiversity conservation there are two types of habitat loss which are habitat destruction and habitat fragmentation habitat destruction refers to the complete removal or destruction of habitat typically due to the human activities such as deforestation urbanization mining or agriculture this process directly eliminates the habitat and resources it provides for species which leads to loss of biodiversity and ecosystem services habitat fragmentation occurs when a large continuous habitats are divided into smaller isolated patches this division is usually caused by human activities such as roads agricultural fields urban areas or infrastructure development fragmentation disturbs connectivity between habitats isolating population of species and reduce gene flow habitat destruction and fragmentation both lead to a loss of biodiversity by making it harder for the species to survive reproduce and adapt to changes in their environment here are some examples illustrating the impacts of habitat destruction and fragmentation on specific species cutting down forest in sumatra and borneo this is primarily for timber and palm oil plantations which removes the natural habitats for many species including orangutans tigers and various bird species next deforestation in western ghats this affects species like long-tailed macaque and nilgiri thor both of which are endemic to this region and highly dependent on the forest habitat for their survival habitat fragmentation in the himalayas caused by roads buildings and human settlements affects species like snow leopard and himalayan monal coastal development disturbs habitats vital for species like olive ridley turtle which nest on specific beaches and the indian skimmer a bird that nests on river sandbanks poaching of wildlife refers to illegal hunting capturing or killing of wild animals often for their valuable parts such as ivory skins for medicinal purposes here are some specific examples tigers are poached for their skin and bones elephants are targeted for their ivory tusks rhinos are killed for their horns believed to have a medicinal properties musk deer sought after for their perfume glands bears are poached for their gall bladders used in traditional medicine corals and shells are collected for export and sold illegally on beaches wild plants are over harvested for their medicinal purposes including species like raw wolfia nexwamica and datura and garden plants like orchids ferns and moss are illegally collected for commercial sale and here are the causes and consequences of wildlife trafficking the causes of wildlife trafficking includes high demand for wildlife products such as rhino horn and elephant tusks weak enforcement of wildlife protection act allows trafficking to thrive economic pressures can drive individuals to engage in illegal wildlife trade as a source of income and this leads to decline in wildlife populations and extinction risk and disruption in ecosystem balance and biodiversity loss 
when wildlife declines local communities and countries lose money because it affects tourism and jobs that rely on animals here are the examples of poaching in india rhino poaching in national parks elephant poaching for ivory in various states tiger poaching for skin and bones in various states and the mitigation strategy includes strengthening law enforcement and anti poaching efforts to catch and deter poachers reducing demands for wildlife products through awareness campaigns and education help locals to work so they stop poaching as human settlements expands the clash of spaces intensifies which leads to humans and animals harming each other and this is called man wildlife conflict causes of human wildlife conflicts includes animals losing their homes because people are building cities and roads animals eating crops and attacking livestock that belong to people people building houses and farms where wild animals used to live and this leads to human injuries and fatalities wildlife deaths economic losses for farmers and local communities and here are some examples of human wildlife conflict elephant human conflicts in kerala tamil nadu and karnataka tiger human conflict in maharashtra madhya pradesh and uttarakhand leopard human conflict in maharashtra gujarat and himachal pradesh there are some simple mitigation strategies for human wildlife conflict creating paths for animals to move safely between their homes giving money to farmers when wildlife damages their crops or killing their animals and making ways to solve problems between people and animals without fighting local communities can help to protect wildlife by making decisions together on how to keep animals safe india is home to vast array of unique and fascinating species many of which are unfortunately endangered or endemic endangered species include iconic animals like asiatic lion bengal tiger indian elephant great indian rhinoceros are facing significant threats to their survival endemic species of india includes both flora and fauna flora is the term used to describe the plants it encompasses a wide range of plant species including trees shrubs herbs grasses ferns mosses and even microorganisms flora is often used in conjunction with fauna fauna refers to the animals that live in a particular region or ecosystem together flora and fauna make up the biota of an ecosystem kurinji pitcher plant indian ghost orchid are some of the fascinating plant species which are under threat due to habitat destruction over exploitation and climate change animals like lion tailed macaque nilgiri tar himalayan monal and indian pangolin which are endemic species found in india threatened by habitat loss poaching and other human activities The International Union for Conservation of Nature and Natural Resources IUCN is the global authority on the conservation status of species. The IUCN red list categorizes species based on their risk of extinction. Critically endangered species includes Malabar large spotted civet, Namdapa flying squirrel, Salimalis fruit bat, Sumatran rhinoceros. Endangered species includes Asiatic lion, Asiatic black bear, desert cat, great indian rhinoceros, indian elephant Threatened species includes Indian wild ass and leopard. Here are some alarming statistics related to biodiversity and conservation. One million species at risk of extinction due to human activities, and sixty percent of primate species threatened with extinction. Seventy-five percent of world's fisheries is overfished or overhunted. Up to one trillion species could be extinct by the end of the century if no action is taken. These numbers show we must act now to stop biodiversity loss and protect ecosystems. And that's all for this session. Thank you so much.